This is Duke University. As we mark the 150th anniversary of the start of the Civil War, Duke history professor emeritus Peter Wood says the lesser-known work of artist Winslow Homer provides context on a turbulent time period in American history. Wood has a new book, near Andersonville, about one such painting. For Wood, the painting reveals much more than meets the eye. I'm convinced that it's a, it's a profound statement, not just about 1864, a crucial moment in the Civil War, but about war itself, about America itself, about the way we see ourselves. And my sense is that we are only just reaching a point where we can see the Civil War in the way that Homer saw it almost 150 years ago. This picture, it represents a perspective on the Civil War that's much closer to our own, uh, that represents a lot of the scholarship of the last 50 years. For our generation, this looks like an interesting painting of an African-American woman. but. In Homer's generation, this is an absolutely revolutionary painting. There are no other paintings like this. There are occasional pictures of black women as individual portraits or as maids, or they may appear on the edge of some wider painting. But he is putting this person front and center and drawing you into her experience into her head, which is one of the things Homer loved to do. So he's juxtaposing this prison camp for, for white soldiers with the prison of slavery, which she still inhabits. Produced by Duke University, online at duke.edu.